Assalamu alaikum. My name is Dr. Muhammad Shweb. Previously, we studied the introduction and preparation of benzene, and our today's topic is nucleophilic addition reactions and regioselectivity of benzene. First of all, we will see that why benzene is so reactive. Benzene is highly reactive due to the less effective overlapping of e orbitals and incomplete octet. Here we can see that these two p orbitals are not effectively overlapped, while all other six p orbitals are effectively overlapped and the aromatic sextet is still retained. Benzene is highly reactive, it is neutral, having incomplete octet and behave as an electrophile. Its lifetime in gaseous phase is 20 nanosecond and it is stable at very low temperature like 8 Kelvin. Benzene give, benzene give following type of chemical reactions such as nucleophilic addition reactions, pericyclic reactions which are of further many types and at the end we will study the synthetic application. But here in this lecture we will study only the nucleophilic addition reactions. Nucleophilic addition reactions. Nucleophiles are of the type RXH are added to the orthobenzene to give the corresponding phenylated compounds. Under neutral conditions mechanism involve the nucleophilic attack followed by the proton transfer to give the substituted benzene. These nucleophiles can be a water, alcohol, carboxylic acid, alkyl thiol, primary and scanty amine. Next is addition of tertiary amine, phosphine and sulfide. However, addition of other nucleophiles such as tertiary amine, phosphine and dialkyl sulfide takes place in other ways. There are two possibilities. First, if the group is attached to a heteroatom, has a beta hydrogen. Here we can see that this group has a beta hydrogen. Then the nucleophile will attack on the benzene and benzene will abstract a proton, thus eliminating a small hydrocarbon molecule to give substituted benzene. The second case is here where there is no beta hydrogen. Here, the alpha hydrogen will be shifted to the benzene ring and an elide will be produced. Next is the regiochemistry of triple bond formation. Regiochemistry of triple bond depends upon the position of the substituent and the leaving group. There are different possibilities. If a substituent and leaving group are at or though or para position to each other, then only one benzene intermediate is possible as we can see here in first two examples here the leaving group and the substituents are at ortho position to each other and in the second case the leaving group and any substituent these are at para position in first case there is only one possibility of the leaving group and hydrogen to be eliminated thus a triple bond will be formed here which is at the second position relative to the substituent and here in this case uh, there are two types of hydrogen on either side of leaving group but these two hydrogen are similar so there is only one option there is only one possibility of benzene intermediate but if the leaving group and the substituents are at meta position to each other then there are two possibilities of benzene intermediate. Next we will see that where the nucleophile will be attached to the benzene if there are more than one possibilities. In first case triple bond is located in between C2 and C3 as shown here. The negative charge will be ortho to the electron withdrawing group and the nucleophile will be at meta position because the closer the negative charge to the electron withdrawing group the more the stability in the second case the triple bond is in between c2 and c3 
and the substituents is electron donating group. Then there is a little selectivity and nucleophile can be added on both positions. In the third case, where the triple bond is in between C3 and C4, there is no significant effect of substituent. It can be electron donating or electron withdrawing group, but both products are formed. In regio selectivity, another factor which is very important is the steric hindrance or the steric factor. Steric hindrance will keep the bulky groups apart from each other. As here we can see that lithium piperidine, a bulky nucleophile, will be added to the meta position in case of 3 isopropyl benzene. It will be added to meta position here 1 2 3 these are the mat meta position because isopropyl and the piperidine piperidyl both are the bulky groups but in 3 methyl benzene lithium piperidyl the nucleophile is added at or the position as here there is no steric hindrance so the amide nucleophile will can be added to both the positions relative to CH3. It can be at ortho position or it can be at meta position. Another example of steric hindrance is the addition of potassium diphenylamide to 1-methyl 2,3-nephthylene. The exclusive product will be the addition of nucleophile to the position meta to the methyl. These are all about the nucleophilic addition reactions to the benzene and their regio selectivity. In the next topic, we will study the pericyclic reactions of benzene. Hope you got that topic.